So Daddy, what are we doing today? Well, we're going to be doing some electro etching. What's that? Well, electro etching is where you take electricity either through a wall wart, a wall plug, or a battery, apply it to a surface that's conductive. In this case, we're going to test out a dollar store metal, well, hopefully metal, uh, travel mug, and we're going to see if we can etch directly into it. Okay. So our first step is actually going to be to create a vinyl mask. And the vinyl mask is going to be used to help uh, create a negative space that we are then going to etch into that negative space. Okay. All right, so we need to make some masks. Ready? Go. To the cricket. Now that we have our vinyl masks uh, with the transfer paper attached to them, let's put them onto our mugs. Okay. So we were taking off the backing to the vinyl masks. So now we are left with this. And then we should just be able to put this on. Not too bad. Good enough for this job. At least I think so. We'll find out pretty soon here. I have mine on. Alright, I think I'm I think I'm good to go. Yep, same. All right, so I'm gonna put my gloves back on and then let's start etching. Okay, now I'm gonna get my battery and I'm going to put my red wire onto my the positive side, my white wire onto my negative side. So now the negative, you're supposed to take a Q-tip, you're supposed to dip it in the salt water you are supposed to take the negative side and put that on the wet side of the Q-tip. Then you're supposed to take the positive terminal, 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 okay. You're supposed to t take the positive side of the terminal and plug it into the cup. So I'm gonna do that by taking and taping the positive lead directly to the cup. Do that too. And then I'm going to get my negative terminal. And I'm gonna jump over here here for a second. Get my Q-tip all set and ready. Now we are using rubber gloves uh, just for the purpose of you know, helping to maintain safety in doing this. Okay, your mind's connected. Yours is good to go. Let's yep. get the water up here. We add some salt into it. Let's put this right here on the mat. Add some salt. Keep going, keep going. Add some salt. Yeah, there you go. All right, go ahead and stir that around. Cup. 
Now I have a wet paper towel, and I'm just putting the negative terminal to that, and just seeing how that's doing. I'm gonna lift it up now. Ooh. It's coming out. Just clean it. Okay. So I don't know if this is actually etched into it or not. But we'll see. I think I'm done. What about you? Not done yet? Almost. Big reveal. All right, let's see yours. So what does it look like? What's the verdict? The tie is not off, and there's a little piece there, but I think it has etched on it. All right, I'm gonna try mine now. Mug actually came out. I mean, my fingernail can grab the edge of it. It definitely etched in. All right, so proof of concept. Can you etch a $1 dollar store travel mug? Yes. Yes, you can. All right, well, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed, please like and feel free to subscribe.